what is up everybody i'm twinkie this is black betty and this is my moto vlog so today i'm taking a trip up to a buddy of mine's uh he's got a bike too he actually used to live next door to him but uh i hit him up earlier said hey you want to ride it just filled up and uh he says yeah i was uh, just about ready to to go out myself so i said all right well let's uh meet up <laughs> so i heading up to him now and then uh from there god knows where wherever the road takes us so one thing that you'll come to find out is i love back roads i love cruising along the back roads going around the turns flowing with the road just having fun and and indulging myself in the feeling body like a back road riding with my eyes closed i know every curve like the back of my hand doing 15 in a 30 i ain't in no hurry i'm gonna take it slow just as fast as i can so full disclosure i work a lot with my day job so videos will not be uploaded too often i'll try to upload at least one a week um like on a saturday or a sunday like i said i can't make promises but i'll do my best to do it i do work a lot the other thing i like about riding on back roads is seeing the nice open fields and, and all the tree lines and when you see animals out there grazing in the grasses and all that that's all nice too so just a little bit of background on me as far as riding goes. Uh, I do have plenty of experience when it comes to off-road. Um, I've ridden plenty of dirt bikes and I've gone through plenty of uh, situations. So, and yes, uh, riding a dirt bike is a lot different from riding a, you know, like a sport bike or a cruiser or, or an enduro or anything like that on the street. Because obviously you have, you have different conditions that could affect you differently and you also have different hazards such as people not seeing you like I said it, it's all different in its own ways and that was a really big bug and I have a big smear across my visor anyway so I've been riding uh, street bikes off and on um, up until about about three months ago uh, yeah, about three months ago. Uh, I was off and on a little bit here and there throughout the years. Um, I had two bikes previously, two road bikes. But um, the first one I had, uh, it, was, it was a whole big mess. There was things wrong with it. I tried to get parts for it. Then I ended up not being able to get a title for it. So I couldn't even ride it. So I ended up, uh, I ended up selling that without the title as like a, as like a parts bike to, to somebody. And I got way less than what I put into it. But what are you gonna do? It is what it is. So my second bike that I had, it was uh, it was a bike that was sitting for a while, so it, it needed some work, it needed some love. Um, the bike, unfortunately, some things happened uh, throughout the years, and uh, some things happened in my life, and I needed to sell it before I could even get it running 100% and uh, get it registered and insured and inspected and, and fully road legal. So that bike, I did put a lot of time and effort into that too and I had to let it go. You know, uh, unfortunately things happen in life and you know, it, it is what it is. But this bike here, my third bike, my third road bike, Black Betty is her name. <laughs> it's a uh, 2000 Vulcan 1500 Classic. Uh, it's got a tornado manufacturing uh, manufacturer's air intake as well as Manson Hines straight shots uh, for exhaust. I'm not sure what jet kit it has in it uh, because I didn't put this stuff on, I didn't put the kit in, but I did have to readjust things because whoever did put the kit in didn't put it in right. But she's running good now and that's what matters. So yeah, I have about uh, three months consecutively under my belt with about a month here and there for these other bikes and then uh, I have a couple years worth of off-road experience so I'm 
definitely not new to the two-wheel crowd. Uh, I, even when I was a kid, I used to ride my bicycle everywhere. Uh, BMX bike, mountain bike, whatever it may be at the time. Anywhere I could go, I would go. And it was fun. So this will be my first moto vlog that I will be releasing. So don't come at me with super harsh comments. If you do, I'll just block them. But either way, you know, I am open to criticism constructive criticism that is and uh, as well as some tips and, and tricks if you guys know anything if you guys want to share any uh, any info and experiences let me know uh, I'm all about learning new things I'm all about uh, finding ways to better myself and my equipment and the things I do and, and all that so right now uh, what I'm working with is I have the GoPro Hero 5 black uh, I have that in a waterproof case and then I have the GoPro, the actual GoPro uh, mic adapter for it. And I have a replacement microphone that plugs into like your Xbox and PlayStation headsets um, with the, uh, the 3.5 millimeter uh, plug on it. I have one of those attached to an extension that's wound up in the middle like a foam cord uh, to uh, keep everything tight but still allow room to travel further because obviously GoPro's on the side and my microphone's like up in the front here so I needed a little more room to go with it um, so it wouldn't pull out and get caught up and, and rip out of the, the plug and all that oh that's nice whoa so that's pretty much what I'm set up with nothing fancy, nothing top of the line um, the GoPro, I bought that used off of eBay for 150 bucks, but hey, it does the job. It uh, records when I want it to. Got a 128 uh, Samsung Evo S micro SD card in it, so I can definitely, definitely store up everything I need to. So right now, I am back into the historic town of Adamstown, Pennsylvania. It's uh, just across the Lancaster County line, and uh, I used to live up here. Uh, I lived up here about a year ago, and uh, I was here for about two years, a year ago. And uh, it's a pretty quiet place, but uh, I didn't want to change jobs, and my commute to work was just a little too far every day. So I ended up moving a lot closer to work. everybody so this is Keenan he is my buddy uh, we are heading up to uh, I think he said it's called the pretzel hut um, asked for one of ice cream I said no he said we can get it anyway It sounds better. Yeah, it's like... I thought it sounded different when you came up. It's how it's supposed to sound. It's good <laughs> sound. Yeah, man. Ah, 
by with my little eye a bike for sale. Ooh, there you go. Look at all the pretty cows. You know, if those lights and the mud flaps of that trailer were covered, I think this would be one of those perfect moments where when you have a sleeping passenger, you wake them up screaming, and when they look forward, they see a bulldozer pointing towards you. Yeah. I feel like that would be like a perfect setup for that. <laughs> Alrighty, so we're here at the Pretzel Hut. We got some ice cream. Munch down a little bit. And now it's starting to rain. So we're going to get out of here. I was gonna zoom past you and then you started hooking left, so I'm like, ah, oh, shit. <laughs> now you're good, I'm like, I, like, <laughs> like, 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 I pulled out wide, I wanted to go come over, I booked, I fucking looked back, I'm like, oh, shit. <laughs> That's alright. <laughs> Say hi to YouTube. Who? YouTube. Wow. <laughs> Go past the car. I was thinking about it. <laughs> it's not too late. It's never too late. Anybody want to buy a fire truck? <laughs> starting to rain so I am getting the hell out of here oh yeah it's uh it's starting to rain <laughs> haven't really ridden in rain yet wasn't really looking forward to it but here we go oh, they're building a new house down there 
here. Looks pretty nice. Oh, I don't see any raindrops here yet. So, I think we're going to be alright. I think we're heading out of the rain. So much for uh, the weather channel saying it's not supposed to start raining until 9 o'clock. It's like 4.30. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where are you going? Use a turn signal. Mm, I can smell the fresh cut grass. Is it on the road? Oh, look at that. Yes, it is. It's on the road right there. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I definitely fished out pretty good there. 